so this time this is a uh, seven elements to stock vertical yagi for the BHF amateur band going to Bulacan for black shadow Mr. John John Mendoza so let's check the antenna configuration each element is secured to the boom using uh, an element mounting bracket it's a, it is attached by a screw and nut to on each element so each element is numbered accordingly you just need to put back the corresponding elements with numbers on the boom and on the elements so we have a mid mount antenna or middle mounting as this is a little bit long for end mount but if you want to install it separately you can use the end mounting which is also provided on the antenna so this is a gamma match Yagi we have the gamma tube the feed point in, is an SO239 connector attached to the directly to the boom make sure that you tighten the nut on the SO239 connector we have the PL259 connector on the pacing harness so you just need to put it and tighten the connector. This is directly attached to the boom. We have the plastic spacer on the Yagi. You just need to secure it with cable tie. So we have the pacing harness. This is a 75 ohm coaxial cable cut on the center frequency at uh, one, four, one fourth wavelength. Multiple compensating the cutting with the antenna or the coaxial cables below velocity factor. So check your coaxial data sheet for the velocity factor this is attached to the T connector going to the feed line so make sure that you tighten the connectors this is the T connector we have an RG8 coaxial cable for the feed line let's check the other side still on all elements are numbered properly according to their uh, to their positions on the boom so same co configuration we have gamma match same position of the tuning stub we have the plastic spacer so let's check the frequency response of this antenna we have an RG8 coaxial cable for testing going to the N121SA antenna analyzer so this is the frequency response so let me focus the camera as we can see here we have 1.1 SWR on the center frequency or the exact dip on the carb at 146 megahertz so this is the comb con uh, combined or, or is the configuration so let's check the impedance is 45.33 ohms reactance is 3 ohms S11 is minus 24.35 dB so let's check the
frequen frequency going up. So 146.5 is 1.3. 1.47 is 1.3. 1.47.5 is 1.2. 2 going to 148 at 1.2 148.5 is 1.2 149 is 1.2 149.5 is 1. 4 or 1.35 150 is 1.4 1. so let's go to the lower band 145.5 is 1.37 or 1. 1.4 145 is 1.55 or 1. 1.6 144.5 is 1.6 1.78 143 is 1.9 and 142 is 1.9 so this is the individual frequency response 142 1.9 going to 143 1.9 144 1.8 145 1.5 146 1.1 let's check the other frequency on 145.2 is 1.5 145.3 is 1.4 145.4 is 1.4 145.5 is 1.41 145.6 is 1.37 Still 1.4 145.7 is 1.3 145.8 is 1.26 145.9 is 1.2 And 146 is 1.1 So going up 1 1.3 1.6 1.7 1.3 1.8 1.24 1.8.5 1.24 149 uh, is 1.3 149.5 is 1.4 and 150 is 1.4 so let's verify this frequency response on the nano VNA